take a look at these pictures. What do you see? They seem to be scenes from a hot climate, perhaps in Europe. They're not by a professional painter. They seem a little awkward. They're oils, unvarnished. They've been painted on canvas paper, popular a few years ago when fully stretched real canvas was expensive. You don't know the artist, but to me, they are utterly familiar. They were on the walls of the house I grew up in. They were painted by my father, Tony Bonner, in 1957. I know the exact date because they were painted the month after I was born. They are of Torremolinos in Spain, where he was staying alone. I think there's a prevailing idea in the culture that the birth of a child is the happiest time of anyone's lives. But for people like my father, the life-changing event of my birth, the sheer responsibility of it, brought on a bout of anxiety and depression, which he suffered from intermittently throughout his life. For him, one of the ways he handled depression was actually by being among other people, whose company he enjoyed. He was a member of 15 clubs. So it was odd that his doctor prescribed for him a holiday by himself in Torremolinos, then just a fishing village. There weren't any drugs for depression then, so getting away from it all was the best he could offer. So Spain and the paintings. He must have been proud of them, else why have them up in the house? But to me, they always seem suffused with loneliness. My father's illness carried with it an unhealthy dose of social stigma. I think he felt deeply ashamed for the complicated feelings he had when I was born. The enforced isolation that an artist usually has when painting seems to me the opposite of what he needed. In any event, after that experience, he never seriously painted again. Looking at them now, I find myself filled with a desire to enter into them, to travel back in time to that hot hillside in Torremolinos, and to tell the anxious man with the easel and the canvas paper not to worry about the future, that he will come through, that he will, despite his worries, turn out to be a great father. <laughs>